GER Detect in cooperation with its exclusive agent, UIG Detectors, presents to you a comprehensive guidance on how to assembly and operate 3D GER Analyzer. First, turn on the tablet device. Then establish a connection between the main unit and the tablet by clicking on the Bluetooth icon located to the right of the taskbar. Select Add Bluetooth Device. Bluetooth will search for devices near your tablet. Then Deep Seeker Bluetooth will appear. Click on it and choose Pair. A window will appear to enter the password, which is 1000. Press the Next button to complete the pairing operation between the tablet and the main unit. After pairing has been established, click on the Bluetooth icon again and choose Open Settings. The window for Bluetooth properties will appear. Choose COM ports to see the outgoing port number which will be used later in the analyzing program. Close the window and run 3D GER Analyzer. After opening the program, click on the new scan icon. A window for adjusting the settings of imaging will appear, which is as follows. Choose device. Select device name. Example, Deep Seeker. Interface. Enter the outgoing port number obtained from Bluetooth properties already open. Transmission method. Choose Bluetooth. Operation mode. Choose ground scan. Impulses per line, designed to determine the number of images within a single line. Example, choose 10 photos. Number of lines, to determine the number of lines to search for. Example, choose 3 lines. Scan direction, to select the scanning method during imaging. There are two methods of scanning, either scan in one direction or two-way scanning, back and forth. For example, choose two-way scanning. Then press connect. A warning message will appear. Press continue to complete the process. We will walk in consecutive steps at the distance of 30 centimeters between every two steps. Taking into account keeping a 30 centimeter distance from the first line while scanning backwards, alongside pressing the imaging button for each step. During the scanning process, a 3D image of the target being imaged will appear on the tablet screen. After scanning is complete, we will have a three-dimensional image which is made up of a grid of squares reflecting the number of steps and lines that have been scanned. Example, we have a grid of lines consisting of three columns and 10 steps per column, which means three lines of scan and each line consists of 10 images captured. For detailed information about a specific point within any square, we move to this square by pressing the up and down navigation arrows for the program to give the following data. The depth, impulse, line, and value the up and down navigation arrows. To reduce image height, use the drop and height icon of the image. The triangle and point icons are used to distinguish the image more clearly and reduce the mineral salt surrounding metals and cavities, and also to bring the image closer to a geometric shape. To open an image previously saved, click on the open icon and then press the reset button. To close the current image, Click on the close icon. To save the image in a format that can be analyzed later, click on the save icon. To save the image in a JPG format, click on save as image icon. To print the values report, click on the print report icon. To reset the image to default, click on the reset icon. To hide or show grid lines, Click on the grid icon. 
To zoom in or out, use the zoom in or zoom out icons. To see the image from several directions, click on view to see multiple options. Full screen. It gives you the possibility to maximize and minimize the window of the program. Top view. To see the target vertically from top to bottom. Side view. To see the target from one of the sides. Perspective view. To see the target from the other side. Toolbar. Through the toolbar, you can hide the tools and options columns on the right, left, and top of the program. To see the photo in 2D, click on the icon of the color you wish to see in 2D. You can also hide a color by clicking on Hide or discard and merge it with the color of the soil, which is green, by clicking on Colorless. If there's a difference in values between a photo and a same color photo following it is large, or if there's any sudden change in value, this indicates that there's an unidentified object, metal or cavity, which can be seen clearly in the photo. For example, we have the following values, 60, 65, 75, 140. The high value photo, which is 140 in this example, is conclusive evidence of a real object laying directly underneath. However, if there's a difference in values between an image and another image following it is close without any sudden change in value, this stands as evidence of the non-existence of any target. 3D GER Analyzer is available in several languages. English, German, Arabic, Turkish, Russian, and French. Moving to the image captured, it is divided into four colors as follows. Red color, which stands for metal color. Yellow color, which stands for mineral salts. Green color, which stands for soil color. Blue color, which stands for cavity or void color. We wish you all the best in your detection journeys.